gonna also scooch myself down a little. Ah, uh, the breeze, the smell, so much like home. Home? Do you mean the world you're from? Yes, this place is just like the Sakai Plains. That's where I was born. Uh, I remember their beauty well. When I was young, those plains seemed to stretch forever. It truly is wonderful scenery. And the wind is so pleasant. It makes me happy to hear you say that. Even if this is not my true homeland. We woke at dawn and tended to our cattle, caught game, and slept when the sun set. That was every day of my life growing up on the plains. But it didn't last forever. Can you tell me what happened? The Lorca tribe, my people, were attacked by vicious bandits. They killed so many of us. The bandits were cowardly. They poisoned our drinking water, then attacked in the chaos. Whoa. That's terrible. Yes, but the Sakai Plains are our motherland and have always blessed us with their bounty. It is a place I love deeply, though it holds many painful memories. Enough mourning. The sense of this place is exciting me. Ready your sword. I'll show you the true skill of a Lorca tribe warrior. I can't wait. You oh, she's about easily. to kick our butt, I've isn't she? I've overcome so many hardships in my life. She's about to and kick come, our butt. Sure. But our butts. bond will grow stronger with this fight, as will my power. So whatever you do, don't hold back. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well. Mm. Wait. She's gonna. Sweet. Wow. You beat me soundly. You're very strong. And you were as skilled as I expected. Very powerful, too. I wonder if I could be like you. If I grew up on the plains, I mean. <laughs> Perhaps. I learned to fight out here. But I learned more when I met Elliewood and Hector. We traveled long and far together. Sometimes we compete with one another, just like this. They helped me to learn of justice and courage. And they gave me the strength to trust others. And that strength has made me who I am today. When I woke, I had no memories and no one I felt I could rely on. But now I have so many friends around me to teach me about the world and about myself. Mm. I hope that at the end mm. of my journey, I'll be as strong as them. And you. You'll definitely become much stronger. I'm sure of it. Of course, I'll help too. Thank you, Lynn. Okay, wish me luck. It's been a hot minute since we played. I have a feeling I'm gonna die a lot. I think I'm gonna die a bunch a bunch. The cold voyage. Oh. <laughs> Fail gave the ring of the holy night to the divine dragon. Zaddy? A zaddy? What? Goal. Okay, so we've seen him in his dragon form, and this is his human form. Damn, Sombron. This man is uh, scarier than Ganon, for sure. Oh, I can't wait to rate all the characters. We're gonna do that. It's gonna be fun. Apologies, my lord. The ring of Azure Twins lost as well. Twice my four hounds failed me. You do understand the gravity of all this. Yes. And Vale. Still in a deep slumber. No matter how much I amplify her draconic impulses, she won't awaken. She refuses her true nature. In that case, Take this. Uh, what is it? An enchanted helmet. It will strengthen the spell you cast on her. My power with your spell will correct what is wrong with Vale. He's kind of dreamy. <laughs> Keep it safe. Use it when the time is right. Of course. As you will it. There is something else I would like to discuss. What? 
Pardon me, Lord Sombron, but Lady Vale is your only child, correct? My only living child? Yes. That is correct. Of course. I was speaking from fear, not fact. Forgive me. Why ask such a thing? Vale believes one of her siblings is alive. I thought it best to raise with you. She spoke of an unbroken dragonstone. Hmm. But she must be mistaken. We both know the truth. Your children were killed in the war a thousand years ago, all but Vale. I remember one who stood above the rest with hair and eyes like fire. What was the name again? Something like... Zephyr. My lord. I do not remember all my children's names or faces. But that one I killed myself. No. This man had so many kids. He's like... <laughs> He's like, I don't know. I don't know, bitch. I don't know, but I killed them all. I damn sure killed every single one of them. <laughs> yes. Moments later, I was imprisoned. Did you collect the body? I... I did not. Then I rescind what I said. <laughs> the answer is no. And if you find that offspring, bring me a corpse this time. Yes, Lord Sombron. As you wish. Oh my god. Pure evil. Thanks for arranging the ship for us, Alfred. Thank my mother, not me. When I said we were headed to Elusia, she got one of the fleet's finest lined up. How was everything at the capital? Well enough. There haven't been any attacks since we left for Brodia. What a relief. I told Mother what the other side's been up to, how they're after sovereign blood. She was shocked, of course, to hear about King Morian and King Hyacinth. Understandably so. As for the destruction at Flora Port, the royal family will spare no expense on aid, though it may be years before the harbor is returned to its original beauty. We must defeat the Fell Dragon so that such horrors never happen again. What's our plan? When we arrive, do we head straight for Elusia Castle? First, we should try to learn what we can from the Illusion people. Rings or no rings, if we don't know what we're up against, we could lose everything. Besides, there's something I need to find out. And what's that? Whether Vale is all right. Hmm. From our vantage, the Hounds certainly didn't seem pleased. They may attempt to erase her personality. If anyone can do it, that woman can. I know Vale killed my mother. Nothing we've learned changes that, but I can't help but worry about her. I hope she's not hurt. Yes, I suppose she's a victim in this too. And she did risk her neck to give us the ring. Or it was all an act and she's just gaining our trust to stab us in the back. Again. That's worth considering. We don't know enough to rule anything out. Still, I want to trust her. Divine One, excuse me. Two ships flying Illusion colors approach from ahead. Any sign of the hounds? None. However, it appears the enemy intends to attack us. Then we've got no choice but to fight them on the water. Prepare for battle, everyone. Oh my god, I knew it. I knew it! Mimi, you're gonna have to get down. <laughs> Air fryer better today. I love air fried Elugia's pizza. Inside. So I've returned. What? Are you all right? Whatever has become of Elusia, I'll still do what I must. Love air fried pizza. Air fried anything. I haven't. I really. The only thing I use my microwave for now is um, like soup. Yep, soup. <laughs> That's it. That's all I use in my microwave. Oh, popcorn. I like popcorn a lot. It's one of my 
It's one of my favorite snacks, popcorn. Um, when I had dogs, they really liked popcorn too. And so I would like share my popcorn with them. It was very cute. My cats are, they, they're picky. They don't eat shit. <laughs> Giver Port is a little farther north. I suggest sailing there. Understood. It's near the castle and the cathedral, so we should be able to gather intel there. I will inform the others of our destination. <sighs> oh, what's wrong? Marth. Selica, Micaiah, Micaiah. We returned without you, but oh. we'll get you back this time. Just hang on. Oh my god. Oh. OT! Hi! But return then to the land where we were separated OT, from our what's up? What a but I appreciate it. I was like, oh, you think I'm tall? Cool. Cool. Okay. All right. I'm definitely not. I'm I'm like 5'3 at best. I think I might be under right under 5'3 now. Fun size works too. Yeah. I like a fun size. Who doesn't love a fun size? You know, you can they fit in your pocket easier. You can bring them more places, less bulk. Carry them around in your hand. We can at last grant the power we offer once every thousand years. We should discuss our other option. That is, the far greater power only we know about. Yes, of course. The miracle. We could use that power at long last. I would suggest Lumera. I don't like this idea. We shouldn't perform the miracle. We have to think of the future. I agree. The whole future. We can't favor anyone with it now. What? Favor someone? We're talking about Lumera. We can prevent a tragedy. Please. Those of us who were scattered in other lands are still learning all that's happened. Some of us were at her castle. Some were not. It's natural to see things differently. So, we are not all in agreement. At least at present. Using our power every thousand years is one thing. The miracle. We've never used it before. Uh-oh. Never in all of existence. Oh? The cost of doing so is not small. Perhaps we should never, ever use it. Oh, God. <sighs> of course, we are not all here. What might the others think? What might they decide? Whoa.